Hello, it's story time. Going to read The Rainbow Zebra. If you know me, this is one of my favorites. I got this book for my daughter when she was a baby. That was 31 years ago. I don't know who the author is or who the illustrator is, but it's a beautiful book. Here we go. The Rainbow Zebra. Is that okay? Once in a jungle far away, a herd of zebra spent each day. They grazed on grasses in the sun. They pranced and played and had great fun. They all wore stripes of black and white, which to the zebra seemed just right. Black and white's the way to be, they all agreed contentedly. They were quite happy with their lot, except for one. His stripes were not black and white, but a brighter hue, yellow, green, and red, and blue, like a rainbow. All right, here we go. The little zebra said with a sigh, I want to be like you. Oh, why can't I be black and white too? Not yellow, red, and green, and blue. He tried to scrub his stripes away. He tried to cover them with clay. He tried to fade them in the sun, but nothing worked. No, not one. So finally, one dismal day, he waved farewell and went away. He told the herd, I must go see if somewhere there's someone like me. Okay. So we'll try it this way. Here we go. Here we go. All right. He walked and walked until he came by chance upon a place called Jungle Ranch. Here, he said, I hope maybe to find one, someone who looks like me. He met a leopard wearing lots of splendid orange polka dots. A silly green gazelle was there. A sleepy lion with red hair. He met all sorts of jungle creatures with bright colors and pleasant features. You're nice, he said, as nice as can be, but none of you are striped like me. And so he walked for hours and hours until he came to the land of flowers. Their smiling faces were green and blue and red and pink and yellow too. But none of you are striped like me, the zebra sighed unhappily. And now quite tired, he lay his head upon a fragrant flower bed. He woke again to thunder and lightning the rain so heavy it was frightening. A dreadful storm had come to pass. It took, shook the trees and shook the grass. It comes after a, a big thunderstorm sometimes. Yep. Beautiful rainbow. Look at that. And when at last the storm passed by, a rainbow arced across the sky. The zebra smiled with great delight at seeing such a wondrous sight. A rainbow's beautiful to see, and it's striped just like me. So from that day, he took great pride in his own multicolored hide. Back to the herd, he brought a glow the beauty of his own rainbow. And you all have beauty. 
You all have your own way to shine and to bring your glow to the world, to your family, and to yourself. Have a beautiful day. Bye.